The Uchomi Retail Enterprise succumbed to heavy debts with its suppliers, landlords and hundreds of its employees who admit they must now contend with uncertainty. No termination letters, no benefit given, no salary for September and October. We are just in the stuck. The government of you. Serving this for good. Um, the money, a lot of money, the tune of more than 34 million. The line of frustration on how the employees of Uchumi will cope in light of their pending two-month salaries and job termination is also raising concern. The other aspect relates to the role of trade unions and, um, and the government labor department. I have not heard something substantive coming out, which position is, is, is out, what is the fate of the staff, do they have something for them, how do they stabilize after a sudden uh, loss of jobs. This particular set of confusion on the fate of over 500 workers of the grounded supermarket chain has seen the workers' union remain on the defensive. We have Federation of Uganda Employers, which actually also these Wuchum people are, must be members. They must be br brought to order. The labor laws are very clear about termination of workers. Now, what the way forward is that we need to come together. Since they are not in our union, but we are now volunteering to help. Uchumi's seven branches within the city and other three major towns of Gulu, Bali and Barara have now been formally shut down, with the head office in Nairobi announcing a similar fate for its Tanzania outlet where workers in thousands remain unemployed. Reina Ojo, NTV, business.